All right, start. <laughs> okay, so uh, my name is Mason, and I'm going to be making a uh, bowl on the pottery wheel today. So the first thing to do, and this is actually the hardest part of pottery, is to get it centered so that all the clay is in the same spot, going in a circle around. And the easiest way to do that is to take your elbow, stick it into you to create a stabilizing force, and you just hold your own until the clay is going the right way. So the first thing that I do is I take my uh, piss and I just kind of make a little divot in the middle. Just turning my, my wrist like that. And then I take my sponge and I just push right down to the center. And then I pull the, push the clay from the inside out towards my hand. You see the clay naturally kind of wants to go out, so you kind of have to hold, collar it in as you're pulling, throwing it, whatever. <laughs> and then I compress the bottom. And this is where I start pulling the clay up from the bottom. Usually it takes about three good pulls, but we're going to just go ahead and work with what we got here. So I want to support the clay on the outside with my hand there and start making a bowl form with it. So the first time I usually use the sponge. Pressing the outside from where I trimmed it. And then I'm going to take this tool to really give it a good bulk curve to it. Once you start spinning, you stay spinning, and it's going to take some effort to cause you to stop and change. And so your angle all that, actually changes depending on the size. So she has more control of it when it's bigger, and, and more control it on the there. Back here. And let's see and one. Once it's dry enough, I can move it and trim up the bottom. Up bottom. Right, so you cut it off while you were okay. spinning it. Yep. Uh, cool. Cool. <laughs> and then what's right. the next Over step? Here. Just yeah, cool. from so you here. Let it dry a little bit, and then. Um, 
I remove it from the bat and I flip it over and I, I so center it on the wheel again and I have these little like wire loop tools that I kind of just trim out the bottom. Alright. That's how you make a wall. Awesome. Thank you, Mason. Thank you. <laughs>